viewers and subscribers you're welcome back again on this platform where we tell you undiluted truth let me use this opportunity to first appreciate and congratulate all biafran people globally who celebrated the biafra memorial day on that yet may to be honest with you the enemies of justice equity and fairness the enemies of truth had done it again in Aba, where we had about the unfortunate incident about the killing of um, military men and the rest of them. I must tell you that it did not come to some of us as a surprise. Because after Alex Oti came forward to say that they are not going to confront or try to harass or try to undermine the target me in Abia State. It didn't go down well with the politicians in Abia State. Of course, when we saw somebody like Greeno Omokri distributing LSOT position, it says so much about the sponsors and those who are behind all these killings and all these um, armed and violent crime happening in the name of Biafra. There is no there is no reason whatsoever for you to go out there and start killing people and start causing all manner of tension in the name of remembering your heroes in the name of Biafra Memorial Day no because the ultimate victims of these actions had always been the Biafran people now tell me why a, 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 a true Biafran would get involved in such activities in such heinous crime if not the sponsors of iniquity the political class i'm not surprised to see that there are so many defections happening in abia state after the pdp have apologized for their 25 years or 24 years of a mess in the government i start seeing them jumping from pdp to apc and for the fact that Alex Oti had won the heart of the people, they tried to rob Pote on what the man is doing by stirring up this drama. But I can tell you, it will not deter genuine Biafran people from pursuing a righteous cause lawfully. Underline that word, lawfully, because that is the position of this platform. Anything you must do, any agitation you are doing, whatever thing you are asking for, we believe on this platform and we preach due process of law. That is the position of the elders in council of indigenous people of Biafra from day one. And up to today, any group that does otherwise is not pursuing or agitating for Biafra self-determination. And they are probably being sponsored by workers of iniquity in government especially from biafran lad who are stooges and worst example of political class you have in nigeria because all they do is to bring death pain and sorrow upon the people what's your take on this video help me share it so that we de-escalate the propaganda of this government of Nigeria who is determined or or the political stooges who are determined to spread false news and misrepresentation of what Biafra truly means it is your duty to do that I've done my bit happy share this video what's your thought on it drop it on the comment section bye bye for now